to have someone step in and say, you guys are awesome, we want to give this to you, was really overwhelming and humbling for us. Um, it's hard to accept help sometimes, and we were in a position where we just couldn't do it without help. Back in December, we brought you the story of the Barris family from Boise. Bridget and Ben Barris have 18 children, 14 of them adopted. Ben had just been diagnosed with delimitating uh, ALS, a devastating blow. The family's home wasn't handicap accessible for his wheelchair, making it nearly impossible to get around. That's when a local businessman stepped in and saved the day. Tommy Alquist was so touched by this story that his company, BVA Development, offered to renovate the Barris' family home at no charge. Well, months later, that project is now done thanks to dozens of local subcontractors and companies who stepped in to help. This week, it was time to celebrate the renovation with the people who made it happen. We were there. Here's our Maggie O'Mara. The Barris kids are getting ready for a big parade in front of their newly remodeled Boise home. Chalk art, music, balloons, it's a party. Inside, mom and dad are in awe of the transformation. Well, the home you're standing in now looks nothing like the home that we started with back in November. We got a phone call from, from Tommy who said, hey, I want to help. From there, we are now have an accessible bathroom, an accessible master bedroom, accessible kitchen, which really allows us to live as a family. The major renovation meant the family had to move out for two months. I stayed in a hotel for 54 days, uh, eight rooms, three, three floors, yeah, three floors. We ate meals together in the conference room. But now they are finally back home. Son Bronx can't believe it. It's definitely opened up a lot more room and not only for uh, my dad, but for all of us to come and gather, play board games, talk, all sit around this table. Um, it just means it means a lot. That's great. That's what it needed to do, and uh, we're really happy that they're back in. Tommy Alquist says it was an honor to help this special family. We just knew immediately we could help, and that's the kind of people we have working at BVA. A parade of people who worked on the house drove through the Barris' cul-de-sac. I think originally we probably would have had a big celebration here, but with COVID-19 and social distancing, we needed to do a parade, and a parade was kind of fitting. And, a, you know, the family being there, it's kind of, quite a visual to pull up, and I saw a lot of tears in the eyes of the people that drove by, so... I know I had tears watching it, so it got pretty emotional. All the contractors were so excited to come and celebrate with the Barris family, and it was cool to have them come by. Ada County uh, Sheriff, you know, Bartlett sent his troops too, so I want to thank all of them for coming today. Here we are in the middle of a crisis, and they're still giving. Uh, that says a lot about this area in the Treasure Valley. They went out of their way to make it extremely special. To see Tommy and his team and then all the subcontractors and the community that has just enveloped our family with love and our children's friends and teachers and coaches who have, they may not have done the remodel, but they've been the emotional support we've needed throughout this journey and will continue to need throughout this journey. So we feel well loved and supported and we are in just incredibly grateful for all of it. Each car or truck that drove through was given a special gift. It's a little succulent and it has a picture of our family and it says, uh, thank you for being such an important piece of our story because we couldn't have done this without them. For the Barris family, thank you will never be enough. We felt hopeless. We didn't have the answers that we needed. We didn't have the resources we needed. It all hit so fast. And when I tell you we were hopeless, we spent many nights crying to the Lord to answer our prayers. Super emotional for me because um, there's so many people that this family blesses. And I don't know if they realize it, but um, from the moment you meet them, uh, you just walk away going, wow. To all the people who made this home a wonderful place for the Barris family to be together. I would just keep saying thank you because um, it's definitely blessed our lives. Uh, yeah, I probably just keep saying thank you. You are Seven's Heroes. Indeed, for a full list of the generous construction companies and the other donors who helped make this happen for the Barris family, just go to the story on our website. Now, as for the family, they say they're going to soak in every moment that they have left with their dad. Home is the very place to do that, especially 
now.